a woman's reproductive hormone levels continue to drop and fluctuate for some time into postmenopause, so any hormone withdrawal symptoms that a woman may be experiencing do not necessarily stop right away, but may take quite some time, even several years, to disappear completely. Any period like flow that might occur during postmenopause, even just spotting, must be reported to a doctor. The cause may in fact be minor, but the possibility of endometrial cancer must be checked for and eliminated. Indications and Signs During the menopause transition years, as the body responds to the rapidly fluctuating and dropping levels of natural hormones, a number of effects may appear. Not every woman experiences bothersome levels of these effects, the range of effects and the degree to which they appear is very variable from person to person. Although these effects are sometimes referred to as symptoms, that word is strictly speaking applied to the effects of maladies, whereas menopause is not a malady but a natural life change. Effects that are due to low estrogen levels for example vaginal atrophy and skin drying will continue after the menopause transition years are over, however, many effects that are caused by the extreme fluctuations in hormone levels for example hot flashes and mood changes usually disappear or improve significantly once the perimenopause transition is completely over. All the various possible perimenopause effects are caused by an overall drop as well as dramatic but erratic fluctuations, in the absolute levels and relative levels of estrogens and progesterone. Some of the effects, such as formication crawling, itching, or tingling skin sensations, may be associated directly with hormone withdrawal. Both users and non-users of hormone replacement therapy identify lack of energy as the most frequent and distressing effect. 14 other effects can include vasomotor symptoms such as hot flashes and palpitations, psychological effects such as depression, anxiety, irritability, mood swings, memory problems and lack of concentration, and atrophic effects such as vaginal dryness and urgency of urination. The average woman also has increasingly erratic menstrual periods, due to skipped ovulations. Typically, the timing of the flow becomes unpredictable. In addition the duration of the flow may be considerably shorter or longer than normal, and the flow itself may be significantly heavier or lighter than was previously the case, including sometimes long episodes of spotting. Early in the process it is not uncommon to have some two-week cycles. Further into the process it is common to skip periods for months at a time, and these skipped periods may be followed by a heavier period. The number of skipped periods in a row often increases as the time of last period approaches. At the point when a woman of menopausal age has had no periods or spotting for 12 months, she is considered to be one year into post-menopause.